This video will demonstrate the best way to use the Schoology calendar when you're on your mobile device. So here I am logged in on my iPhone. I'm logged in as a parent. And right now what's showing is just the, uh, the recent activity that would normally show up when you log in on your home screen as a parent. I'm gonna go ahead and click on the little hamburger icon, which is the three horizontal lines up in the upper left corner. When I tap on that, all these other items show up. So you can see I'm logged in as Gwen Finch, who's a parent, and I have these various options. I'm gonna tap on my children. And what that's gonna do is give me some um, options to view my kids' um, uh, activities, their um, courses, their grades, a summary of what their, their activity looks like. So as you can see right now, I'm viewing the activity of Jean Scout Finch up here. I can uh, go back and forth between the various children, but let's stay with Jean for now. And these are the updates that would usually show up for Jean when she's logged in. But since I'm logged in as her mom, I can view what her um, recent activity feed looks like. Notice that there's an option for grades and attendance and also calendar. I'm gonna tap on calendar. And this is gonna show me Jean's calendar. So you can see um, the various items. Here's, um, you can scroll down through the month view of the calendar and see the week view. And then I can tap on any one of those items and I have the option to view that item. And I can tap to view the entire item. So the reason this works is because what I'm looking at right now is an actual web version. So while you're in the app, when you use the calendar, it actually um, allows you to view items like you would um, on the uh, when you if you as though you were on the web version. So that's my best recommendation for using the calendar and accessing assignments that way on the um, while you're on the app.